Modern farming equipment can be more useful than ever. In today's video, we'll show you some modern machines. So keep watching till the end. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Green peas are eaten in almost every part of the world. And here you will watch how modern machines harvest them using state-of-the-art technology. In 2018, HMC revealed its fleet of four pea viners. These machines come equipped with modern rubber tracks, which reduce soil compaction. An RTK has been incorporated into these machines. It is a satellite guidance system, just like GPS, providing an accuracy of one centimeter. This guidance system makes it easy for operators to steer their machines to follow the optimal path resulting in less fuel consumption. The scanning technology actively measures peas' health and quality. On monitors, operators can see good and poor areas of the field in real time and can target where to harvest to ensure only the best peas are harvested. Some people get upset whenever anyone brings up the topic of self-driving machines because they worry that their jobs will be eliminated. However, owners and manufacturers are interested in their benefits, and one such is that they can help increase food production. Let's have a look at the VTE. This self-driving tractor can operate all hours of the day and night. It is the brainchild of two well-known machine manufacturers, Crone and Lemkin. Its creators tested it for a year for a variety of jobs before releasing it to the public. Using a three-point hitch and PTO shaft, the wide range of attachments can be attached including plows, harvesters, sprayers, and other such attachment units. Extensive sensors on the tractor ensure it follows the optimal path, reducing soil compaction and fuel consumption and improving production. Currently, it is controlled via a radio control system, but in the future, it will be controlled using a smartphone. This will allow farmers to spend less time in the field and more time as systems operators. Next, we have another autonomous machine, aka the Auto Agri. It looks like it came from the future, but this amazing design is given for a reason. Overall, the tractor is 50% lighter than the regular tractors thanks to the hollow rear. The lighter weight not just reduces fuel or energy consumption, but also reduces soil compaction. The Auto Agri has GPS, radar, and other sophisticated sensors enabling it to work on its own, whether it's day or night. It is available with either a hybrid powertrain or pure electric drive, resulting in low carbon emissions. Operations can be executed using a remote controller with precision. It is equipped with a CAT2 three-point hitch, a power takeoff PTO, and hydraulics to accommodate equipment designed for conventional tractors as well as new equipment that further exploits the autonomy's new possibilities. Farmers spray chemicals to control various pests, weeds, and disease carriers. But spraying crops is not as easy as it seems. These chemicals are expensive, and blindly spraying them on crops is not just costly, but ineffective. However, the Airbus 4000 has made this task super easy. It is an autonomous spraying system that scans the plant to make an optimized analysis of the environment. It even sprays chemicals with a controlled flow according to the size of the plant, providing energy efficiency and reducing fuel consumption. The Airbus 400 comes standard with a 130 horsepower engine, four-wheel independent steering, and a 4,000 liter fuel tank. It can navigate around obstacles, make tight turns, and work with multiple machines.
For years, farmers have been sowing seeds by hand, but then came planter machines that made their life easy. The Uniport 500 is such one. This modern planter is self-transportable, offering 49 to 61 planting lines. It has a pneumatic system that, in conjunction with a seed planting unit, plants the seeds in the correct quantity and spacing. A gas spring system has also been incorporated into the planting unit, which applies a constant force of the planting line to deliver a uniform depth of the seed. The Uniport 500 features an 8,700-liter seed tank, enabling it to complete an entire shift with just one fill. Also, tires, cutting discs, and other parts can be easily changed by removing just a few bolts without having to take apart other parts, which reduces the maintenance time. Next on our list is the FAE PT300. It is a mulcher with tracked undercarriage designed for the most demanding operations, such as managing woodlands and forests or building fire breaks near power lines and oil and gas pipelines. It is compatible with a broad range of FAE hydraulic equipment, including forestry mulchers, cutters, stone crushers, stump cutters, and dozer blades. It comes standard with an A-cert straight six engine that allows it to function on steep slopes and soft terrain. The hydraulic system ensures reliability and efficiency. When it comes to comfort and operator safety, its roomy cab is unparalleled. The machine is comfortable working on steep, soft, uneven, and marshy terrain. Forestry mulchers, cutters, stone crushers, stump cutters, and dozer blades can be attached to it. Before we say anything about the final machine in our video, it's important to talk about compost, which is a mixture used to fertilize and improve the soil. It is prepared by decomposing plant and food waste and organic recycling materials. Therefore, it must be turned periodically for better and more rapid production. To do so, CompTech has developed the Top Turn X55. It's a compost turner that works well for small to medium-sized composting jobs. The environment-tight cab is where the driver sits. The new cooling system keeps the cab cool even when the outside temperature is high. They also include a hydraulically extended maintenance platform that enables quick maintenance access. With its unique drum design and patented scraper bar design, you can ensure complete mixing of the window from outside to in. Well, hey there, lovely people. 
please don't forget to sound out in the comment section and to subscribe to Lord Gizmo. We'll see you next time with another interesting one.